Um, and then there was a fire in one of the houses and they all burnt down because they were obviously all... Is it called? Oh, wow. Not thatched cottages. Well, they probably were thatched cottages, mm-hmm. but they were all um, terraced houses. That's the word I was trying to look for. Oh, I didn't realise. Yeah. I was like, oh, wow. Poor Marlborough. I think it's nice, nice shops here. I mean, Dividers has got some nice places as well, though, doesn't yes, it? Yes, they do. They've got, is it the nice. Rambles or the... Is it called Shambles. the Rambles? Shambles, that's it. That's oh, one. yeah. Yeah, that yeah, looks quite nice down there. Yeah. Shops, not so much chains, which is quite nice. I think the only thing with Marlborough is that because it's quite expensive for rent, they don't have um, many independent shops. They've got a nice one now, though. I've not been in it called Packaging Not Included. Have you seen that? Oh, is that up in that by that? Um, Hugh and Dignard? Restaurant or somewhere. Oh, I don't know. Basically, it's a lady who's opened up a shop where she sells as much as she can that has no packaging. So there's no plastic or anything. It's all recyclable. It's all reusable. That might be that you one. You bring your own corner. stuff. Because next to that is a cafe, which we went in. I've seen that shop there uh, okay. in the corner. Sort of like in a little yard. Yeah, yeah. It's Hewind and Yard. That's right. That must be it. Man. It's a good idea. It's the way. You have to yeah, go they have one in Cornwall, I think, where you can just bring your own Tupperware and fill it with peanut butter and, you know, so here you can see is one nice, lovely big corn. I'm using my scoopy blade to take that out. Just slowly, 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 so it doesn't hurt. I've obviously prepped the skin with some Hydrex, which is like an antibacterial solution. Um, and probably also use some hydrogen peroxide to just soften the skin to make it more gummy rather than hard. And it's coming out so nicely. I'm really pleased that I've managed to capture it at this angle because... Um, I'm using a tripod camera, which is not easy. But when removing this corn, what was interesting is that it wasn't just one in the area that you're seeing. It was actually two. It almost looked like a staple corn where you've got two either side and it's covered by like the top, which is a mushroom styled. I'm not quite sure what the word is for it, but essentially it was a two in one corn. So satisfying to get out. If anyone else out there is a podiatrist and watching this, if you have any comments or any tips on things you do or you like to use when get... Oh, there it is. It's out. Lovely. And there should be a shot of it coming up shortly where you can see what I mean, that there's two under one area. And I just don't know what is going on there. So, yeah. See if I can get some more out because I tend to find that I need to scoop out a little bit more of the hard skin. Um, basically, core it out. You're coring it out like it was an apple or something. And I would have included the talking in the consultation, but I think there was a few little personal things that were being said. So I thought better take that out because nobody needs to know anybody's business.